Oh, they didn't give you Quran, did they? Yeah, they are good, they are good. Yeah? yeah. Did they treat you well or? Yeah, they treat me well. Yeah, and, and, nice guy, nice guy. and, and you I find Islam, them. good teaching in Islam? Yeah, yeah. The guys, they, they are like proper brother. Mm -hmm. It's in Islam where I'm working. Yeah. yeah. And, and have you ever thought about it, yeah. about Islam? Yeah. yeah. But you, you are a Christian as well, right? Yeah, I'm a Christian. But you know, you yeah. know how, what we believe in Jesus, right? Yeah. And I know, I know. how do you, know you see guys. him? Do you see him a, as a prophet or how do you, or do you see him a God? Yeah, as a prophet. Prophet, I right? I see him as a prophet because uh, he's, he's just human like us. He's, he was, yeah, he was yeah, human yeah, like yeah, us. yeah, yeah. But he, people say he was sent by God, you know, mm. to, to teach people the right thing, you know? Yeah. Might be true. No, so I think, you know, what's your name, brother? Isaac. Isaac, it was nice to meet you, Isaac. Nice My name is... My name is Aziz, yeah? Aziz, yeah Isaac yeah. is a, a beautiful name, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so Isaac, I think your belief is more of a Muslim, although you label yourself Christian. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> I don't know how that working out together for yourself. Mm -hmm. But because you believe him a prophet, like a man yeah, who yeah. eat food, yeah. right? Who, who sleep, who drink, yeah, who sleep. take rest, just like yeah. human beings, yeah, right? Yeah. You know, uh, all, all prophets are just human beings, you know? They are they are not like um, something else they're human beings right sure, sure. Yeah. and uh, jesus christ's message was to worship allah the creator <coughs> he he never said to worship him do you believe that who should be worshipped allah alone or allah with jesus christ allah alone yeah yeah definitely because he's the one of the power he's the yeah. one is the creator he's yeah the sustainer one, yeah who's the cherisher, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. And, uh, but what about the concept uh, of the last prophet? Do you believe Muhammad, peace be upon him, is, is a messenger? Oh, yeah, yeah, because, you know, I had a story about him. Yeah. He it's, it's, it's a message, isn't it? Yeah, he's a messenger, so. And he tell us about Jesus as well. So we have um, a, a chapter number 19 in the Quran chapter called Mary where the account of Jesus like stories of and also we have chapter 3 and other chapters right it covers the stories of Jesus mm -hmm. and it is important to know the life of Jesus through the lens of Quran because Quran is the the word of God yeah. you know it's memorized by millions you know mm -hmm. it's preserved and it's memorized by millions of people that's only yeah, one yeah, copy, yeah, you know that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's yeah, only so one single like, copy. Yeah, a lot of fallings, you know. Yeah, and it's been memorized by children, mm. uh, like six years old, from seven, eight years old, you know. Okay. And Allah said, you know, He will make this Quran memorization easy. And Allah said, وَلَقَدْ يَسَّرْنَا الْقُرْآنَ لِلذِّكْرِ فَهَلْ مِنْ مُدَّكْ So Allah made the Quran memorization easy, you know. So, you know, you know that has... Quran brings those lot of evidence that Jesus is a prophet of God. Okay. And now, Isaac, just I think what you need to do, maybe read through the Quran and see how you feel. Because you already knew that Jesus Christ is not God, is a prophet. Yeah. Yeah. And but, he, you know, it's all evidence show he's not a God. He's not God, he's, yeah, absolutely. He's not a God. You know, why people believe he's a God? Yeah. But he's just human like us. Yeah. And uh, he's just being, uh, you know, I think, uh, I think people consider he as a God because uh, he used to be, uh, I would say, he uh, used to protest against the government. Mm -hmm. uh, people said Jesus, isn't it? Jesus he used to be against it, what uh, the government used to do, you know what I mean? Mm. And what people used to believe in, he used to tell people the truth, don't believe in this, don't follow the government, what government do, the government, uh, they are not, you know, the government never been right to tell people the truth. All these things, it's like, a, I don't know how to explain that. It's, yeah, that's another way to call it. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Muhammad peace be upon him, mm -hmm. his message is not new message. 
So his messages align with uh, all the message, message of the prophet, like you know, Prophet uh, Abraham, Prophet Noah, Prophet Jesus, Prophet Solomon, Prophet Zachariah, Prophet John the Baptist, all of the prophet. You know what? There's one singular message all the time. The message never changed in worship Allah alone. All the same, the same message. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Isaac, you know, I think you know, you know it already. No, no, no. And I think what you need, maybe, I mean, as a brother in humanity, I would ask you maybe go through the Quran and maybe also read the story of Prophet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like you know? it. I like to read it. I like it. I like it. Because this life thing, is, thing, yeah. yeah, this life is very short. Still. Very short. Yeah. Sure. yeah? Still. We don't have the guarantee of our life, you know? No. We, we don't know when is our last breath, yeah? We don't even know, yeah. Yeah, and before yeah. that, we need to make sure that we chose the right path, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, sure. And, and right. you have Muslim friends, so... Yeah, yeah, I work with Muslim guy. Yeah. Uh, very nice guy. Always talk sometimes. We make joking, talking yeah. every single day. We work like it. Yeah, yeah. And then Islam, Islam, Islam brings solution for the problems as well. Mm. Not about just to believe in God. It offers the total solution for our problems, right? Okay. Like socially, politically, economically, family-wise, it gives solution for all every angle. It has values, and those values were not compromised with the social values. Okay. Did you see how Christianity compromised the, its value to yeah. fit with the society? But Islam never compromised, you know? It stand up with uh, Allah said alcohol is forbidden, you know, don't drink alcohol, right? Don't gam, don't yeah. cheat, yeah? You know? you know, all these rules in Islam govern you. Because look, we are a, a social being, you know? Yeah, yeah. We need to have those governance to, you know, guide our life, you know? Otherwise, we'll be, you know, fall apart, you know? Yeah, 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 sure. You see, so Islam, brings you that angle, cover that angle. But at the same time, we have to look into the belief because belief dictates the action. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Yeah. And um, do you believe the Bible corrupted? Oh, the Bible. Yeah. I, you know, there is Bible, yeah? Bible being changed. Yeah? We been changed Bible. We Bible was as one uh, honestly one original Bible by the we human we change it. We change it and make it the way the way we like, we want. Yeah. The government change it, make it the way the government want. Mm. You know me? Mm -hmm. The government Christian, the government like England they got Christians, isn't it? Mm -hmm. They change the Bible, make it the way they the And way I'll they, I'll show you a verse in the Quran. What it say about it, and you will be surprised. Let me open this one. Yeah. <coughs> Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. So this says, "Fawailul lil ladina yaktubun al kitab bi yadihim, summa yaqulun haza min andillah li ashtaru bihi samanan qalila." So, "Fawailul lahum min ma kitabat aydihim, wailul lahum min ma yaksubun." Okay. Isaac, you can read it for yourself. So, Allah is saying. Woe to those who write the scripture with their own hands. Mm -hmm. Then say, this is from God in order to exchange it for a small price. Woe to them for what their hands have written and woe to them for what they earn. So Allah, you know, the reason of Allah sending Quran is to clarify what people are doubting. Alright? So any doubt can be removed by looking at the Allah. This book is called Muhaimin, right? So it will authority over other books. Because Allah is seeing that the scripture has been corrupted. Do you think Allah will leave me and you in confusion by having a corrupted book? Or do you think Allah will send another book? Allah will send another book, right? Yeah, he, he... Yeah, no. Because you know, Bible is corrupted. Allah is watching you. 
Yeah. So Allah said so Quran. Definitely, definitely, yeah, exactly. Book, yeah. So that's why Allah sent. That's also another reason. There are multiple reasons Allah sent messenger. Allah sent the Quran. But one of the reasons that Allah is clearing out the misconception, misunderstanding, mm -hmm. or or the wrong things they have learned about Jesus Christ. Yeah. And Allah clearly mentioned he is son of Mary in the Quran. They were saying son of God and Quran addressing, you know, his spirit, you know, his uh, Messiah. You know, we believe that he healed leper, he gave life to dead through the permission of Allah. Yeah. All of the things he done through the power of Allah. Yeah. yeah. So, his message is clear, yeah, Isaac. Yeah, you, yeah, easy, you know, I think Isaac. Um, I think, you know, we have, we have uh, house, uh, enough intelligence. Yeah. Enough knowledge to understand yeah. uh, what's what's wrong, what's bad, you yeah. know, what's true. What You're a very somebody. honest man, Isaac. You know, because I have spoke to many Christians and then don't like to admit that Bible is corrupted, yeah, yeah, right? Lots. And uh, and and also they don't like to mention you know don't, don't like to accept the fact that trinity is a made up thing right uh, but isaac you know you're an honest man and i you know i ask allah to guide you to to islam you know because this is if you really love jesus the jesus religion is islam because he said i worship allah you know allah jesus said inna allah rabbi wa rabbukum fa'buduhu haza siratun mustaqim yeah? So Jesus worship Allah and that is the true path, mm -hmm. right? Now, if you really love Jesus, follow Islam. And I'm making a formal invite to Islam, Jesus. And you wanted to be a Muslim? Do uh, you know, be a Muslim? I, I don't think so, but I just want to understand. Yeah. Oh, really? Is anything holding you back? Is there, yeah. is there anything holding you back to be a Muslim? Oh, because you know, if you I know it's see, true, then yeah, yeah. I just see like the we most the most important, most important we need is love each other. We should just no, 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 I think... love it, mm -hmm. and uh, for the fact when we love it, yeah, everything will be nice, good. Yeah. When we we have hate in our heart, we do bad things. Yeah. That's, that's I, I don't disagree with the, I doesn't disagree with you Isaac in fact I agree with you these are the essential attribute a human should have with when we behaving with humanity but we have another thing which is missing which is the relationship with the creator now imagine Isaac you are good to me you are kind to me and you are discussing with in a manner that we appreciate you know you appreciate me I appreciate you but what about the creator who gives you the oxygen? You know the free oxygen you're receiving? You know the water you drink? Everything is free, you know? You didn't earn it. You didn't earn it. It was given free. You didn't grow it. Then now imagine the one who's supplying those oxygen, the water, right? And all the blessing. And suddenly said, okay, Isaac, I've given you my quota. I'm going to stop it. Oxygen. I'm going to stop supply of water. What will happen to you, Isaac? Yeah, yeah, yes. definitely we will die. Now, yeah, knowing, knowing that, oxygen. knowing that we're receiving those blessings, mm -hmm. what, what God want from us then? Yeah, because God, God gave us, God gave us everything, isn't it? He yeah. Gave us everything. Yeah. We. Yeah, we have everything, you know, we should be uh, grateful. Yeah, now, in order to be grateful, Jack, Isaac, I'm sure you will agree with one point. The point is, we have to be obedient to God. Hello. Would you like to take a copy? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Isaac, you know, obedient. Yeah. Like, you know, if you, if you work for your boss company, the first thing they want you to obedient to the company's law. Yeah, you follow the command of God. Allah wants, you know, Islam means submission. And submission means you are saying to Allah, look, I'm not going to follow my way, by your way, and I'll be obedient to you. Yeah? 
So in Quran, it's called Sami'una wa Atu'una. Mean we listen and obey Allah. And that is the condition of worship, like we obey Allah. And then when we obey Allah, how to obey Allah? By following our desire or follow the messenger? What do you think? Yeah, follow, follow follow messenger right yes, now Isaac now you you are a you are a grateful man to to uh, uh, to your friends and family mm -hmm. but how come you're not showing gratitude the way Allah want means no, no, do, 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 do you get my point yeah we yeah we should be grateful yeah everything and done. first point we have to obedient isn't it but we, yeah, but we don't need to be crazy, doing some crazy thing, by, sometimes people forget about, about their life. Yes. And they will be in the church like every single time, pray, every single hour, pray, pray, pray. God, I don't think God need that. God need it. We just, just be, Grateful, but we don't need to be like every yeah. single time. You know, some people they be they will be in the in the mosque or church or whatever, yeah. they, over every single hour. Mm. Like they do everything, everything they sacrifice themselves like for God, like crazy. Some people go mad. Some people just yeah. go mad. I think they Isaac, don't need to good, be, they good, don't need good. To be like that. They don't need to. It's a good question. Yeah. It's a good question. I'll tell you why. You know. Even whole the creation doesn't worship Allah. Yeah? It will not decrease or increase Allah in his status. Now imagine, imagine, Isaac, I give you 10 pounds. Okay? I give you 10 pounds, right? Like, yeah? That's a literally, I'm going to give you 10 pounds. No, what would you know? I'm just. just you, yeah, yeah. yeah, you're not sure. Yeah. Okay. What do you say to me? Thank you. Why did you say thank you? Thank you because uh, it's a kindness. Yeah, kindness. It's a gratitude. Kind, now, are we giving anything back to him? So Allah is not asking your way to be worship. Allah is asking, are you not going to be grateful? Do you see? So we are asking, we are thinking that Allah is on need of my worship. Allah is not need of anybody's worship. <laughs> you see? He doesn't need. Allah is giving you unconditionally. You know, unconditionally. Like, you know, when you, when you give your children food, yeah? This is also, you find the satisfaction in you. These are conditional. But Allah's love is unconditional. You know, He is giving you this beautiful life. And every blessing you are enjoying, right? So it is our duty to be grateful. Because why? If we don't do so, we are actually finding ourselves in self-destruction. Means we will fall into the category of ungrateful people. And Allah said, ungrateful people will have suffering awaiting for them. And the grateful people, Allah showed another route that Allah promised paradise for them. So Isaac, you don't want to change your nature. You already are grateful to the creator, creation. I'm just asking you, add another layer and start worshiping Allah. Look, Allah said in, in this verse, and you'll read for yourself. Isaac. Uh, that is in chapter number two. Uh, Allah said, uh, last verse of chapter two. Yeah. Allah said, La yukallifu Allahu nafsan illa usaha. God does not change. Charge a soul. A soul within its capacity. So <laughs> he knows you, Isaac, how much load you can take, right? He knows inside out, Isaac, right? You only need like the whole day, maybe 20, 25 minutes of the prayer. And yeah. think about the blessing. And now imagine you admit to hospital, right? And you need half an hour oxygen each day. How much will it cost? It costs a lot. It costs a lot. But even if you work full day, you won't be able to repay the half an hour oxygen. Yeah. And just think about on this example with prayer that you should be you should 
say Allah, I wanted to be, I wanted to be included on the people of grateful. And prophet, you know, Allah sent prophet to remind those words to the community. What happened to you? Wake up. Wake up because heaven and hell both exist. And Allah said he will do justice. And justice means reward for who do good and punishment for who do bad. Simple. Allah is not beating around the bush. Yeah. And clearly saying that, you know, mm -hmm. the, the outcome. Yeah. Quran, yeah? Yeah, how many? Two or one? Two or one? Okay, let me give you one. One copy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, thank you. Have a lovely day. Yeah. Yeah. So, Isaac, you know, I have given you a lot of information. And I really want you to think and take those information, right? And but one request I'll have for you as a brother in humanity, right? Don't make too late. Have a read through the Quran and, and yeah. read through the material, Isaac. And I appreciate yeah. that you're taking time. Yeah. But just think about those stuff we talked about, that yeah. obedience, yeah? Okay. Yeah, that. I've been bicycling over, over here. Yeah. yeah. You've been thinking, I, I can see, you know. Yeah, we always talk yeah. about and share, you know, ask, ask them, you know, because Muslims are, you know, alhamdulillah, you know, praise belong to God that, yeah. you know, helping, you know, sharing Islam. And if you have any question, you know, um, you can reach it to us as well. Okay. Yeah, anyway, inshallah. Um, and I wish you all the best and okay. have, a, have a lovely day to you. And, and let me give you this one, yeah? Shall let me give you this. This is an open copy. Shall I put it on the back? Shall I put it on the back? Yeah. Look after yourself, Isaac. Okay, well, it was a pleasure talking to you. Yeah, thank nice you. Thank you.